everybody, it's Matthew. I am back from Brazil. Um, first thing I did almost when I came back was I went to check on the plants. Uh, I had asked, or about two weeks after I was working, I asked my mom to go over and check on it. And she said things weren't looking too good, the plants were wilting or whatever. And I sent an email saying, well, you can maybe try to plug it in directly to the wall on the house or whatever. Just told her not to really bother with it. I wasn't expecting it to do well or anything. Um, but when I came back, I was surprised. I was really surprised because things weren't dead. Things were alive and looking really good even. And... Uh, there was, out of the 12 plants, there was only one that had died. It looked like it died fairly early on. And everything else was just really green, really green, healthy looking. The reservoir was pretty much completely drained. There was maybe like, I don't know, like 10 liters in there. Maybe less than 5 gallons of water in that thing. Uh... But it was obviously working, and it was on solar power the entire time I was gone. There was some plants I had outside that I had another 12 plants that I just put in the dirt while I was gone, uh, just in case when I came back everything was dead, which is what I was expecting to happen. Uh, so those ones were from the same seeds, and they are about half the size of what uh, what's in the hydroponic system. So really happy. You're, again, I was really surprised to see it actually work. I was thinking on my way back how I was going to make a funny video about dead plants and stuff. And then to, to just come and open the thing up and see, whoa, everything is not dead. Everything's alive. So really happy to see that. So I might make another video here shortly. Uh, there's a few things I wanted to do with the system still. And uh, so maybe make a video about that. The the other garden, the dirt garden, the old-fashioned dirt garden, is also looking pretty good. It's looking a little Jurassic Park in there. So Jurassic Park 3, the scary one. And uh, things are just growing out of control. I uh, need to really pick some of that stuff. I want to thank everybody who has been leaving comments. Uh, guys have given great ideas about, you know, um, how to, to go back to the 12-volt style, not the 110, because... A lot of the small pumps and air pumps and things are probably 12 volt, but they have a built-in uh, power adapter, and those adapters aren't 100% efficient. So if you could remove that and run it as 12 volt, then you're going to have a lot more efficiency. You're not going to be lo losing as much power. And also, everyone who's been subscribing is just encouraging to see and helps motivate me to make some more videos and things like that. So thanks again, and hope you enjoy the update because I did. Thank you.